Hello everybody and welcome back to Skyrim. We are going to continue with what we were doing before with the Thieves Guild. We've got a new follower and we've got to go and speak to the leader, Maven, I think her name is. She's not happy with me because I have time and time again proven that I do things my way. And I'm going to continue to do that because I'm not scared of her. I actually, I don't know what she's going to be like. She'll probably attack me, but we'll see. That's Alakon. Sapphire, that's our new follower. Uh, let's go and see if we can find this maven. What she'll say to me. What do you think you're doing? I don't know. Having fun, dear. Having fun. She's in the pub. Of course she's in the fucking pub. We all get to the pub for a part. If you've got the coin, you've come to the right place. Pull up a seat. People of Riften, heed my words. The return of the dragons is not mere coincidence. <coughs> this is one of the signs. The signs that Lady Mara is displeased with your constant inebriation. Put down your flagons filled with your vile liquids and embrace the teachings of the Handmaiden of Kine. No, no, Maramal. We talked about this. Talon? Kirama, certainly we can come to some sort of an understanding. These people must be made aware of the chaos they've sown. Enough, Maramal. We've all heard of the dragons and their return. There's no need to use them as an excuse to harass our customers. Very well, Talon. I'll remove myself from this den of iniquity. We're not kicking you out. Just keep the sermons at the temple and let us all sin in peace. Blessings of Mara upon you. You've been in Riften for quite I want to know time. more about the Temple of Mara. Wonderful. Where to begin? Mara is the goddess of love. The temple spreads her gifts by tending to the sick, the poor, and the lost. We also perform wedding ceremonies for all the loving couples in Skyrim. Eren, I owe you my life. I could have a wedding at the temple. Yes, if you were ready, of course. Are you familiar with how marriage works in Skyrim? I might. Why don't you remind me? Typically, love in Skyrim is as earnest as the people who live here. Life is hard and short, so there's little room for long courtship. A person who is looking for a spouse simply wears an amulet of Mara about the neck, showing they are available. When another person shows interest and the two agree to be together, one of them comes to the temple and we arrange a ceremony. Okay, I'll buy an amulet of Mara. Here you are. Now, remember, people in Skyrim respond to deeds. You'll find more people interested in your love if you help them. Good luck. Mara bless you. Oh, no, why we get married? Her... Okay, items. Who? Benevolence and safety. What do you need? Interested in me, are you? You are a pleasant company. More than pleasant. And what about you? Would you be interested in a life together? No, sorry. Uh, I'd be more than interested. Good. The two of us, then. All of Skyrim should get ready to stand aside. <laughs> we can marry to her. What, then the two get married? Let's go have fun. Where I'm is he? Oh, I got it to that as well. Where's he gone? I think so. Down here. They're just too frightened to step you up and do something about it. Coming back here after Where's what he gone? you did, Aaron, King Rava. Where's he gone? 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 It's only because I've had an excellent teacher. What's she doing in here? Hang on, before we do that, um. Speak to this one. So you're the one that burned down Golden Glow Estate. She's a yarl. Do you have any idea what that little stunt you pulled is going to cost me? I'm amazed you even bothered to show your face here. Uh, my apologies, Lady Maven. The only reason we're having this conversation is due to Brynjolf's assurance you won't botch another assignment. He claims you possess some sort of uncanny aptitude for your line of work. Quite frankly, I find that hard to believe. Yeah, mind what you say to me. My future wife is right there. Um, 
I am the best at what I do, and I do I do exactly the way I want to do it. Is that confidence I hear, or is it arrogance? Both. Strange how often they're confused. You have to understand. It's been a long time since Brynjolf sent me anyone I can rely on. Well, let me just say this, Maven. Obviously, you have you don't have any faith in the guild, but like I have said to your friends and the people who employed me. I kill. I'm good at killing. I have a, ga a band of murderers with me, and that is how we do our jobs. Faith. I don't have faith in anyone. All I care about is cause and effect. Did the job get done, and was it done correctly? There's no grey area. Oh, I don't want to say that. <sighs> Listen, I'll do the job for you, but I do it my way. Head to the Bannered Mare in White Run and look for Malus Machius. He'll fill you in on all the details. Who does run the show at Hunting Brew Meadery? Some layabout named Sabion. Been a thorn in my side for the last few years now. Okay, so Bjorn seems like more than just friendly competition. Not a day goes by that I don't regret letting Sabjorn get as far as he did. In only a few short years, he's taken that bile he calls mead to market and a chunk of my profits with it. I can't imagine where he found the gold to take it to market so quickly. So, get rid of him, and he's no longer a threat. Exactly. With Sabjorn in prison, his meadery will be forced to close. Then I swoop in and take over the place. No more competition. Why strike now, though? The Golden Glow estate job has undoubtedly interrupted the supply of honey I need to make my mead. Savion could use this interruption to his advantage and collect a larger share of the market. I can't have that. One more time, in case I wasn't clear. You butcher this job, and you will be sorry. I will butcher this shop, and I won't be sorry. Right. Shall we go, my dear? We're going to get married. Yeah, I was going to get married to the vampire, I think, because we did loads of missions with her, but she disappeared. Now, shouldn't you be off arranging our wedding day? Don't keep me waiting. Yeah, I am. I'm going to be... Don't worry, I'm going to... Speak tomorrow about arranging your wedding, and there's that one. Speak to Malleus. Temple of Mara. What do we say? Yo! Don't like those eyes you've got. There's a bad hunger to them. Silence. I'd like to have a wedding at the temple. You wish to be married? It's good to see love blossoming even during these difficult times. Your wedding will be held tomorrow, from dawn until dusk. Don't be late. You don't want to miss your own wedding. Wow, no way. May you return to her benevolence and safety. Blessings of Mara upon you. Okay. So we're getting married. Tomorrow. We could wait and then do it. I'm looking forward to our wedding. You and me. And all these people that are following us around forever and ever and ever. Let's wait. Dawn. Attend our wedding. Ah, here's the proud groom now. Let's begin the ceremony. It was Mara that first gave birth to all of creation and pledged to watch over us as her children. It is from her love of us that we first learn to love one another. 
learns from this love that we learn that a life lived alone is no life at all. We gather here today under Mara's loving gaze to bear witness to the union of two souls in eternal companionship. May they journey forth together in this life and in the next, in prosperity and poverty and in joy and hardship. Do you agree to be bound together in love, now and forever? I do, now and forever. Do you agree to be bound together in love, now and forever? Well, seeming I only just met her, you know, and I only just found out that we could get married, we might as well. Let's do it. Under the authority of Mara, the divine of love, I declare this couple to be wed. I present the two of you with these matching rings, blessed by Mara's divine grace. May they protect each of you in your new life together. Yo, where are you going? This is the happiest day of my life. Where should we live? My home is your home now, of course. We should find a place with room for your kids, though. White run, we could live in Tundra Homestead. White Run, Tundra. We could live in my house in White Run. I'll see you at home then. Don't keep me waiting. Our kids. Mm. Where the bloody hell have you two been? You weren't at the house. You and I were the only people in Skyrim worth loving. That's what I think. Lead the way. Yeah, you come with me. We're not. We're not leaving uh, her here. We can send her home, but no, we'll we'll, we'll bring her with us. I'll make sure she's not going to die. Actually, I don't want to die, do we? Let's send her what home. What do you need? Um. So will you tell me your real name? Look, I don't really know you. I don't what? even really know anyone here. You got married to me. Why do you care anyway? It's not like we're family. We're married. This is a business. We're married. Maybe I'll see you around the guild. All right, love. What do you back need, to... love? Ask anything. I'd like us to move somewhere else. Oh, really? And where were you thinking? Tundra. Tundra Homestead. If that's what you want. I'll see you there soon. Okay, I'd send her there. Um, it's part way. Until next time. So you're going home now, then? Your father will leave us over. So you're going home? Actually, I don't know. Um, do you mind cooking something for me? I hope we bump into each other... He should be, he should be going home. There's my apple home. Let's send her there. Who take her there? Send her there. Listen. Move somewhere oh, else. really? At Please. If that's what you want. Yeah, I'll I want see to see you there. there. Soon. Will she be there? I bet she won't. Let's go there, see if she actually turns up a hole. Let's get a white run. I'll get another follower as well while we're there. I've got a house house car as well, haven't I? Not at this place. Married and she doesn't even know who we are. Do, 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 do. Here we are. Home sweet home. Oh, we've got our dog. Our followers. Here is she. Well, the children aren't even here. Good dog. Good doggy dog. Exactly, good dog. Yeah, look after the dog. The dog's sweet. What are you doing up here? These sands are cold. How can I assist? Hmm? What are you doing in here? Who let you in this place? Yeah, that's ours. She even... Let's wait. I'm going to see if she actually turned up. Don't worry, we're, going to, we're still going to do that mission, but I want to see if she actually turned up here. 
Unless I've actually got to do a mission still to get it to, to actually move in properly. That's funny, we get married and she's like, I'm not telling you my name, I don't even know yet. Why did you agree to marry me? Kids. She's not here, the kids aren't here. Where the hell are they all? Oh, I get this. What are you doing that for? Because um, this is my house, what are you even doing here? I set him on fire and kill him. Yeah, you can be a servant. Hey, dogs. No, he's not, not even here. Right, let's go and get a... Speak to Malice. Oh, Malice is in here. Yes? Who forges your arms and armor? Adrian, at her forge, just outside. The place is named after her, War Maidens. It's a childhood nickname given by her father. What I hear, she was playing with swords even back then. Anyway, our wares are strong and the price is fair. What else matters? Okay. We'll have to have a pint together sometime, you and me. Hey, you won't even join me, so no. I'm gonna get a new follower, bro. I don't know who to get. Oh, we, need, we definitely need a new follower. Can't get the guards to follow us, can I? Do, 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 do. Can you follow us, Commander? I'm the commander of the guard here in White Run. I know, but you won't follow me, will you? You. Oops. Can't a man drink in peace? Maven said you're expecting I'm me. I'm gonna keep this short because we've got a lot to do. Haunting Brew's owner, Sabyarn, is about to hold a tasting for White Run's captain of the guard, and we're going to poison the mead. You got the poison? No, no, that's the beauty of the whole plan. We're going to get Sabjorn to give it to us. The meadery has quite a pest problem, and the whole city knows about it. Pest poison and mead don't mix well, you know what I mean? How do I fit in? You're going to happen by and lend poor old Sabjorn a helping hand. He's going to give you the poison to use on the pests, but you're also going to dump it into the brewing vat. Clever, 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 nice clever, 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 clever. This. All we need is someone like you to get in there and get it done. Now get going before Sabjorn grows a brain and hires someone else to do the dirty work. <sighs> this guy. Why bother poisoning the nest, Fisherborn? Once Sabjorn is out of the way, Maven has plans for the place. One way or another, we don't want the pests coming back. Consider it just more of the dirty work. I did my part getting them in there. Now you need to clear them out. Why are you doing all this? I made the mistake of borrowing coin from Sabjorn. He's allowing me to pay it back, but he's working my fingers to the bone. She want him He to... treats me like a slave. I have to do every nasty, dirty job in the meadery. There's more to this than a debt, isn't there? This plan works. Not only is my debt gone, but I'll be set up for life. Maven and I worked out a little deal. If Sabjorn ends up in jail, she's going to take over his meadery. And guess who gets to run the Blackbriar meadery in White Run? You're looking at him. How do I get the brewing vats? Both of the buildings are connected by tunnels made by the pests infesting the meadery. Okay. There's an entrance to it in the basement storeroom of the warehouse that used to be boarded over. I've already removed the boards so the meadery would get infested. That's where you should start. What about just going in through the brewery? Sebjorn keeps that locked up tight. If you can get through that way, go right ahead. Okay. Remember, Sabjorn will be needing a helping hand. 
Make it look good. I will, I will. Right, let's go and get a new follower as well, one of Matty's. It's a fine day with you around. You look rather pale. Could be a taxi. I, I work for. It's come by Bellathor's shop. At the I'm sure we got, got something. You need. Yes. It was you convinced the Jarl to trap that dragon in the keep. It, it was. By Izmir. It the security in White Run is terrible. Shameful is what it is. Actually, one of the one of our followers is around here somewhere, isn't they? I could get in fact let's go to the companions against one. It's so good to see you again. I'm sure he's actually gonna. A massive weapon. My favorite drinking buddy. Let's get some mead. Azura's wisdom to you, friend. Let's not waste any time. I will have him. We we'll have that. Half naked dwarf, not dwarf elf. Half naked elf fighters fight with us, and hopefully it'll be good. I'm still here. What do you need to take? I don't need to take anything. Don't you want some? It. Gee, that's all you got, man. Can I give you some of good? Some mystic tuning gloves. Yeah, at least put these bloody things on. Yeah, at least put Let's some go. on, dude. Oh, he's got some. That's all right. I'm gonna say, Jesus, he ain't got nothing. I don't mind if he gets killed. Da, da. I don't know what my followers are doing. Last time I saw them, they were in my house. My wife hasn't turned up yet, so God knows what she's doing. We're already having problems. We gotta go over there, ain't we? Mm -hmm. Hello. We are traveling to the shrine of Kinnereth in Whiterun. I hear the Gildegreen is more beautiful than ever since it's been restored. They say that eating the fruit it bears will add years to your life. Okay. You want something from me? All right then. Hello, doggy. What are you gawking at? 
Can't you see I have problems here? Is something wrong? Are you kidding me? Look at this place. I'm supposed to be holding a tasting of the new hunting brew reserve for the captain of the guard. If he sees the meadery in this state, I'll be ruined. I might be able to help you with that, though. Oh, really? And I don't suppose me. you'd just do it out of the kindness of your heart, would you? Nope. I hope you're not expecting to get paid until the job's done. That's the only way I operate. Well, that's not how I operate, so forget it. You better, Royal Skiva. Okay, okay. No need to make rash decisions. Here's half. You get the rest when the job's done. My only demand is that these vermin are permanently eliminated before my reputation is completely destroyed. How do I permanently clear the vermin? I bought some poison. I was going to have my lazy good-for-nothing assistant Malice handle it, but he seems to have vanished. If you plant this in the vermin's nest, it should stop them from ever coming back. You've got a deal. Don't come back until every one of those things are dead. You mentioned someone named Malice. Malice is the best deal I've ever made. Lent him a bit of gold some time ago. I knew he'd never be able to pay back. Nothing what like an, free labor to make jerk. operating costs cheaper. This now guy's I've a got jerk. to clean up this mess. He's a jerk, isn't he? What an absolute jerk. I don't know whether follow it all. No idea. This should be enough though. Maniac. Jesus. I can see where I'm going, man. Where the hell's that guy? He's gonna die next. Where is my team gonna need him? They're all gonna die. What right, an assassin, go get him. You're the only one that can stop him. Who was 
fuck off. Ten years of ridicule, ten years of imprisonment, ten years of exile, the children threw rocks and the women spat upon me as the men found dragged me into white one's prison. They branded me a danger to their pitiful existence, used words like madman and insane. Could the madman escape the prisons undetected? Could the lunatic establish a laboratory right under their noses? Could a psychopath create a mighty army from the common feet skiver? My days as an apprentice alchemist in Winterhold were no better. Those egotistical braggarts couldn't compete with my abilities. When they felt sure I'd constantly excel, did they appreciate my genius? Did they relish my contributions? No. My instructors beat me and said I was irresponsible, and the archmaid cast me into the streets like a common beggar. As my enemies grow complacent and weak, as they forget Hamelin and his utter brilliance, I build my army. I use every bit of knowledge at my disposal to forge their demise. Thanks to your own unwitting assistance, my legion grows stronger every day. The irony that the same ingredients used to make his vile drink could be used to feed any offspring isn't lost upon me. Oh, they will pay. Their ignorance of impending annihilation amuses me. I will bury Whitebrook and watch Winterhold burn, and when they experience the fury I've unleashed upon them, when my progeny, was it, progeny are gnawing the flesh from their bones, they will come begging and groveling at my feet. But there will be there will be no mercy, no quarter, and no leniency, and I will laugh, and I will dance, and I will rejoice over their mangled, broken corpses. The time for recompense has arrived. Ten years of pain. Ten years of pain, misery. Ten years of death. Maniac. Absolute lunatic. I really don't know where my actual soldiers are. They're probably back at home. Oh well, they'll be alright for now. We should find a random strength. Get to murder. Practice does make perfect. Where is the humming brevet? This way then. Hail the 
savior of the Dark Brotherhood. All hail the listener. Turn to him. Which is Gator? Malice is teaching me everything he knows about brewing. Hopefully, I can take over his position someday. Was something we discussed unclear? Job's finished. Well, it's about time. I had to stall the captain until you were finished. What about my pay? You'll just have to wait until after the captain's finished. I suppose you can wait around if you must. Is yours. Jerk. Well, Savjorn, now that you've taken what care of your little pest problem, how about I get a taste of some of your meat? Help yourself, my lord. It's my finest brew yet. I call it Hunting Brew Reserve. I think you'll find it quite pleasing to your palate. Oh, come now. This is mead, not some wine to be sipped on. Brother. By the eight. What? What's in this? I. I don't know. What's wrong? You assured me this place was clean. I'll see. See to it that I you remain in irons for the rest of your days. Again. Please, I don't understand. Silence, idiot. I should have known better to trust this place after it's been riddled with filth. I beg you, please. This is not what it seems. There is murder in the air. You, you're in charge here until I can sort this all out. It will be my pleasure. And you! You're coming with me to Dragon's Reach. Heard even a we'll see how quickly your memory Have clears you in the city's prisons. Now, move! Look, I assure you this is all just a huge misunderstanding. I said, move! Farewell, Savjorn. Ha ha ha, farewell. We are bonded now, you. Bye -bye. And I joined through the powers of the void. I don't think that could have gone any better. Anything else you need before you head back to Riften? I take a look at Shobion's books. So, Maven wants to hunt down Sabjorn's private partner, huh? You're welcome to take a look around Sabjorn's office. He keeps most of his papers stashed in his desk. Here. This should help. Jeez. You never mentioned that lunatic living in the tunnels. I thought it would be better to leave some of the details out of our previous discussion. Didn't want to risk you walking away from the job. Besides, you've done Maven a favor getting rid of him, and saved me from wasting coin hiring someone else to do it later. What are you going to do with this place? Start changing it over to the Blackbriar Meadery West as soon as possible. What? That was Maven's part of the deal. She's put me in charge of keeping the mead flowing, so that's exactly what I'm going to do. If you're in the area, and you ever need anything fenced, you just let me know. Have you heard the oh, thank you. Remember to put in a good word with Maven for me. And the great treachery of Jaden Hall, Kulavoy's mother, and vengeance festers in the sun. I need to go upstairs, don't I? Uh, this way? We are bonded now, you and I, joined through the powers of the void. Yawn. Moving the enclosed crate, you'll find the final payment as we discussed when in Brew Meadwish. Should now begin brewing mead at full production. In regard to your comments about interference from Maven Blackbriar, I can assure you that I'll do everything in my power to keep her asset and her cronies at bay. 
This is the beginning of a long successful future for the both of us. Oh. Wonder who that could be then. In life, I was but a speaker for the Black Hand. That's going to return to Fjorn. Not Fjorn. Maven. What I need to return to. If you've got the coin, you've come to the right place. Pull up a seat. You look like someone who can hold their liquor. How about a friendly contest to win a staff? Um. Drinking contest. You don't stand a chance. Uh, I'll come back. Mm, mm. I'll come back. You're the one from the the Dark Brotherhood. The man I need killed is a seasoned hunter. He's just outside Falkreath. Here's the gold. Oh, thank you. You've a been fine day to you. Follow me. You already appear to have someone with you. you it is crap out. Let's get if going. Go away. I'm heading home. If you need me. Yeah, bugger off. You're rubbish. Well, you might better. I'm right behind you. Why don't you follow me? Glad you're still here. You're way stronger uh, than this one. I owe you my life. You are taking us somewhere warm, I trust. Why? Where have you been? Don't like those eyes you've got. There's a bad hunger to them. That's one of my followers. And the others? I, honestly, like one of the followers is here. The other ones have gone somewhere else. Oh, they do what they want, don't they? The followers. People say Skyrim is one of the most dangerous places in Tamriel. I think they're wrong. Do you it's magnificent, do you and really I'm proud to call it home. Okay. I trust you have good news for me. Job's finished. Easy information you requested. Doesn't tell me much. The only thing that could identify Sabjorn's partner is this odd little symbol. Yeah, I've seen that symbol before. Well, whoever this mysterious marking represents, they'll regret starting a war with me. You should bring this information to the Thieves' Guild immediately. There's also the matter of your payment. I believe you'll find this more than adequate for your services. I believe we're done. Stabbing your foes when you can roast them alive in a gout of Thank you. fire. I believe Brynjolf wishes to speak with you. We're done here. Right, I'm going to finish this video here, guys, Maven. and the next one. How's the criminal underworld oh, no. treating you this fine day? You may have everyone else impressed around. But you don't impress me. You couldn't touch me if you wanted to. You're a cold, unfeeling bitch. What? My dear, you have no idea who you're trifling with. Now I suggest you turn around and rattle someone else's cage before you get hurt. I'm watching you, Maven Blackbriar. One day you'll slip up and your Imperial friends won't be there to catch your fall. Are you being like that? Still here. Lead on. You finally turned up. Jesus, where have you been? What do you want? You have some nerve coming back here after what you did to Kirava. Just get out of here. Welcome to the Bee and Barb, my lord. <laughs> if I can interest you in one of our special drinks, I do what I want. let me know. What she says to me now. Oh, it's you again. What in blazes do you want? I'll come back for Who's these people. There? Why don't you use it? Yeah, we're gonna finish this video here. They obviously don't want me here, but I will. I've got to come back again after I do this mission. The next mission we're gonna be doing. So I've got to go back to the Thieves Guild, which we'll do the next video. Until next time, though, guys. Take care.